Hello, sweet friends, it's Kelly, and welcome back to my channel. And this is such an exciting video collaboration presentation. I have been waiting for this day. It is so exciting. So before I do the reveal of my shadow box, I'm letting you look at my tree for just a second so I can explain. But this was the uh, hosted collaboration by Clarissa over at Kara Mia's Corner. And she had an amazing idea to send uh, a few of us a, a plain shadow box it was actually in almost this color is the little gingerbread that was made by my daughter who's now 27 when she was about four years old this is a very old gingerbread <laughs> and um, she asked us to create a shadow box this is the hashtag Christmas shaker shadow box collab 2021 and it had to be in a winter or Christmas theme. It had to have a shaker element and an interactive element. So that was a super fun collab right off the bat. And then she decided to pair us with a partner. So I actually created this for someone, Paper Kitty, who has an amazing channel, and she created one for me. So without further ado, this is what I made. <laughs> I made a winter wonderland for the little gnome. He is having a great winter time fun. There's the falling snow. What I did is I took the wood that was in this color, more or less, and I painted the whole shadow box white. I felt like it would be a better match for the winter wonderland. Next, I added a piece of designer paper. I think this is from Echo Park with these beautiful little snowflakes and winter swirls. It has little snowmen all over it. Then I added a piece of cardstock. Let's see if I can get a little bit of a close up that is down below. It's about 12 inches long. So I ran it through my die cut machine with a couple of die stitch dies and made my own winter border. Then I added some glitter with glue. So I just um, painted it with the glue and added the glitter to the top. Really wanted to make like a snow bank. And then I added on these little fun winter trees. You might remember these from my Walmart haul. And then the sweet little Nomi, he's freezing, he's cold. <laughs> he wants to go inside and warm up by the fireplace, have some hot cocoa, and he wants to get out of the falling snow. That is my shaker element, is the snow falling. For the interactive element, I decided to go ahead and add a light. And I'm going to see, I'm trying to do this one-handed. The lighted element is right here, and that is the light. <laughs> one of the snowflakes lights up, so there is a battery pack on the back, so that will light up there. And that is my interactive shadow box. I had so much fun making this. I'm really nervous. I don't know if uh, Paper Kitty is going to like this, if it's her style. I'm not really sure if I you know, hit the mark or miss the mark on this one, but I can say I hope I get brownie points for having a good time <laughs> because this was an absolute fun creation. And uh, I really, really love how this turned out and I hope that she does too. I will link all the channels below. I'll have everyone listed so that you can see all of the shadow box boxes in all of their glory and I just really 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 thought this was a super fun idea and a really great collaboration. Thank you Clarissa at Karamia's Corner for thinking to invite me. I am humbled, I am honored, and I had an absolute wonderful time. That is it my friends. I'm going to pop this in the mail. I am also including some gifts for her for Paper Kitty. So this is the only thing I'm going to share with you and I really hope that this is something that inspires you as well to think outside the box and uh, sometimes something as simple as a shadow box and a few little elements. I've got Walmart, I've got homemade, I've got from my house, I've got from my stash, I've got Dollar Tree and everything came together so wonderfully and so much fun. So that is it, my friends. If you like this project, if you could consider giving it a thumbs up, that really helps my channel grow. And uh, leave me a comment so that I can find your channel as well. I love reading what you have, uh, the words that you share and the kind words that you always post. And if you like this content, please consider being uh, a subscriber and it'll let you know when I have more videos up as well. That's going to be it for this one, my friends. I hope you have a no malicious day and uh, blessings to you and happy Christmas. <laughs> I'll see you on my next video, my friends. Bye-bye.